In this video, I'm gonna be showing you exactly what sync licensing is and how it can help music producers and indie artists make a real living from their music. Stay locked in. What's going on, it's your boy Jay Will. And in this video, we're gonna be talking about sync licensing, which is a huge important income stream in my career as a musician. A lot of people are maybe a little bit familiar with sync or maybe has no idea how it works. So we're gonna break it down so that it's super easy to understand. Sync can be a great way for music producers and indie artists to make some extra money based off of what they're already doing, which is making music. So sync licensing is the process of obtaining permission to use copyrighted music behind some type of moving picture. Think about it like this. Each time you make a really, really nice Nice piece of music you've made a hot new lambo most music creators have parking garages full of them and depending on how great those tracks are at telling a story film production studios brands and other media entities can really use them as a vehicle to help them tell a story from beginning to end they could walk they might be able to take a bus but traveling in a expensive luxury sports car just hits different right our music helps them do that but i'm not just going to give them my lambo like that doesn't make any sense but i would let them rent or borrow it for a fee and they need our permission to actually or our car. So essentially what they do is they get a license, perhaps they get pulled over, they can show that they have the permission of both the master and composition owner of said music to be used in a very specific instance at a specific point in time. In a way, it's the best way that we can actually exploit our intellectual property that is our music and still own it. The cost of how much they pay you for the said sync license or permission to use your song can vary greatly. How popular the song is, who holds the copyright? How much of your song is actually being used? Where is it being broadcast? Even how the song is being used? Is it in context or out of context? There's a bunch of different factors. After all this is calculated, what I've seen personally, it can range from anywhere between 250 bucks to like $500,000. Oh, and I almost forgot, it always has to do with how much the budget of the project is as well. If you're working with an indie filmmaker that's making a demo reel for a Pepsi commercial, chances are their budget might not be as big. As an indie music creator, you definitely want to get into something like this because Spotify streams ain't cutting it and being a slave to algorithms like TikTok, YouTube, Instagram, even Spotify is a terrible way to try to actually make a sustainable career out of your music. Your music is worth more than 0 0.008 streams every 30 seconds. On average, what I've seen, it's at least worth four figure minimums. That's not the only great thing about sync licensing. It could actually expose your music to new fans as well. Think about it. What's the greatest platform to get your music in front of people where the tension is already there? Video streaming platforms, Netflix, Amazon Prime. HBO Max, all those. Did you know that Netflix Stranger Things, their last season, was streamed some 286 million hours just that first weekend? Like, could you imagine if you went 250 times platinum within 48 hours? Wild. Unless you're Drake or Bad Bunny, it's not gonna happen. Actually, it probably doesn't even compare because a stream is worth 30 seconds versus a couple million hours, not even close. That alone lets you know that this is the best way to finance your music, because guess what? Anytime that someone hears a song on a TV show that they really like, what are they gonna do? They're gonna take their phone out and start shazamming it. And now you got a new fan that was a stranger that now is rocking with your music for all eternity. This is really, really powerful and is why I'm going to try to help as many artists and producers as possible get started in sync licensing to create another sustainable income stream for them. It builds your fan base, it helps you pay your bills, and it opens up so many other opportunities as a music creator without having to be famous at all, my favorite part. So share with me your questions in the comments and I'll do my best to answer them as quickly as possible with new videos. Make sure you subscribe though, because in the next video, I'm gonna share with you how exactly your music goes from here to the big screen. File to get synced.